what else can I tell you? That people, there, was, there were a lot of bikes around all as you know, mm. in those mm. days, rather than cars. There weren't that many cars. In fact, during the war, very few people were allowed to use a car. People yeah. took the wheels off their cars and put them up in their garage on brakes, mm. hoping that after the war they would be able to use them yes. again. Okay. Um, my dad was allowed a vehicle because he had to go to farms. Mm. The, the district nurse was allowed a vehicle, the doctor was allowed a vehicle. Um, and there weren't many other people who were. I think the, the guy who lived next door to us was a headmaster of the school in Drax. Mm -hmm. and, and he was allowed a vehicle, but not because he was a headmaster, because he was head of the Home Guard. Oh, okay, you know, he yeah. was uh, in charge of the Home Guard in the district. So, um, um, and it was very, it, it would have been quite difficult to get petrol, but there were no road signs in the war. They took the road signs down, so if the Germans came, they couldn't find their way easily. <laughs> and we lived in a white house uh, with a flat roof, and uh, they made my dad camouflage the top because um, it might uh, yeah. be a landmark, you know. Yeah. So those are the sort of things I remember. Mm -hmm. that, that was the house where I lived in Campus, and that was why. It's oh, on the main yeah. road, you know. That, that was uh, my dad actually had that house built uh, in 1934. Wow. So that's architectural, you see. Yeah. Yeah. That was built in 1934 when they, when they they were married at the end of 1934. Mm. Wow.